Mastering Summary Completion Questions for TOEFL and IELTS Hello, learners! Today we're diving into one of the most important sections of the TOEFL and IELTS reading exams. Summary Completion Questions By the end of this video, you'll have a solid understanding of these question types and practical strategies to tackle them with confidence. Summary completion questions require you to fill in the blanks within a summary of a passage from the reading section. The summary will capture the main ideas of the passage but will leave out some key details. Your task is to use the information from the reading to complete the summary accurately. 1. Distractors The reading passage often contains information that seems correct but is actually irrelevant or misleading. It's crucial to avoid these traps. 2. Paraphrasing The words used in the summary might not be identical to the words in the passage. The test examines your ability to recognize ideas, even when they're rephrased. 3. Limitation of words Usually, there's a word limit for each answer. This means you must choose the most precise word or phrase to complete the summary. 1. Read the summary first. Before diving into the passage, get a clear idea of what the summary is looking for. This gives you a sense of direction while reading. 2. Underline keywords in the summary. This helps in focusing on what to look for in the passage. 3. Look for paraphrased information. Remember, the exact words might not always be in the reading passage. Focus on understanding the meaning rather than matching word to word. 4. Be aware of word limit. Ensure you're not using too many words to fill in the gaps. If there's a limit, stick to it. 5. Use process of elimination. Sometimes it's easier to identify what an answer is not rather than what it is. Eliminate options that don't fit or make the summary inaccurate. 6. Reread your completed summary. After filling in the blanks, give it a quick read to ensure it flows well and accurately represents the passage. While understanding the strategy is essential, practice is the key. The more you practice, the better you'll get at spotting paraphrased information, avoiding distractors, and quickly completing summaries. And there you have it. A clear guide to mastering summary completion questions for TOEFL and IELTS. Remember, while these questions can be challenging, with the right strategies and ample practice, you can ace them. Happy studying and best of luck on your test.